Hi, my name is Angie, and I work for the Columbus Metropolitan Library. Do you ever wonder how you can get your little one, your toddler, to sit still for a book? Goodness, do you have an active toddler like some of us? Well, no worries. Now at the library, we like to say a moving child is a learning child. And that means that toddlers and babies and children are naturally active. And moving actually helps their brains. And moving is learning. So you can go with that. Now how do you get them to sit still for a book? Well, use some of the books that we have at the library that have active movement. And they direct the movement. So one like Dinosaurs Dance by Sandra Boyton, published by Little Simon. Now, Dinosaurs Dance is a great one because it has all kinds of movement in it. And you can help direct those movements. And it also has lots of great words. So movement and rhythm and rhyme is helping your little one's brain make all those connections. So it has fun words like shimmy and shake. So what you can do is read a couple pages and shimmy and shake with your little one and encourage them to move their body. Now they might not sit for the whole thing and that's okay. They'll come back because you've made it a fun, active experience. Now there are books, right? But you can also use other activities to help with literacy and movement. So you might have something at home that looks like this, or a scarf, maybe even just a dish towel, right? Maybe you use paper streamers from the store. And what you're, you'll do is have something like this that is fun and enticing, and let's direct some movement. So we're gonna say, shake up high. Hi, right? We're learning vocabulary that way, movement. Oh, let's go in a circle, right? Like that. <gasps> let's touch our nose. <gasps> learning body parts, right? And let's go slow and fast, right? So look around your house. I bet you have something that you can use already. A dish towel, a scarf maybe something, some piece of fabric, right? And practice doing those movements with your little one. So you're giving them vocabulary and words. You're making it active. So by moving our bodies, we're helping make those connections in the brain. So remember, a moving child is a learning child. So keep your little one moving. Don't try to make them sit still for a book. And you will help them get ready for kindergarten.